Hi there, it's Babsy B, and I'm back with two of my books today. We want to talk about more ways to encourage the use of wow words. This week's word being positive. So let's look at an activity that I had this week that was positive. You see, I was talking with a four-year-old trying to explain the idea of the COVID-19 or coronavirus and how we all have to stay in the house and how it reminded me of when I was a child and polio was rampant. So then I was talking about vaccines and how we don't have a vaccine and how those shots always hurt. And when you're four, five and six, you're getting those shots, you know, those vaccines. So I landed on this idea to read from my book, Phonics Through Poetry, Teaching Phonemic Awareness Using Poetry. And this particular poem is titled Chicken Pox. Um, and it's a short O sound, ah, as in socks or pox. The poem is by Carol A. Losey, and I like to say, thank you, Carol A. Losey. Chicken pox. There is a spot, just a dot, not a lot, I feel hot. Got a twitch, just a glitch. Gosh, I itch. Spots in blocks, dots in flocks, head to socks, chicken pox. Now, I was able to use that to talk about with this four-year-old and a six-year-old later. I was able to talk about the idea that I and they now get the vaccine so that we don't get chicken pox. But when I was a child, I did have chicken pox. Today's children don't have to have chicken pox. Tomorrow's children hopefully will have a vaccine against COVID-19.